Well, we're heading back into the mine again. And we're dealing with a little bit of threatening rain. I hope the water levels stay down. But uh, gold's up to 2,000 an ounce, so it's time to get in and do some serious prospecting and mining. I got my brother-in-law with me. We're gonna get him a caribou hopefully tomorrow. So stay tuned. Look at them, little baby ptarmigans. Tomorrow they open, open season on ptarmigan tomorrow. There they go, they don't like to fly. Wonder if there's any more over here. They're right down in the creek beds right now, eating willow buds and berries. We made it in and it looks like it might rain on us. So we gotta get the tent set up. Well, we had something cool happen. A tree got blown off of the hillside there. Nice dry beetle killed spruce. And all our firewood was delivered right to camp. We consider it like manna from heaven. Wall tent on the creek. We hope that this rain just keeps doing what it's doing and it's just this high rain. You can see up here. Just kind of spit and rain. If it spits rain, we're all right. If it downpours, the creek will rise. We don't want that. Well, we got this big stump from that log that rolled down. Dug a few test holes today, did some scouting. Saw a few caribou way up high. About five or six of them. Some sheep up way up high, but they were way out of where we'd go and get them. So poured on us though for a little bit there water changed color but didn't come up much but we got this uh big stump on here and now we're warming up getting ready for bed anyways hopefully we'll find some gold tomorrow and maybe shoot a caribou we'll see joe's glassing this morning not seeing a whole lot the weather's not in our favor We're just hanging out here, looking at the mountains over here. You can see the fogs just rolling across. Not seeing a lot. Did see a few caribou on the mountain top the other night. So, way up there. to spot and you get a big lay of the land and we're hunting for caribou and I just spotted two but this is just gorgeous up here beautiful absolutely beautiful we hunted all yesterday have to no luck Joe's excited first first caribou
Dude, woo! Got him! <laughs> Good work. What? What do you think? <sighs> right in the trail. Thanks, bud. <laughs> uh, how do you feel, Dreadled? <laughs> oh, dude, they move ground like nothing else. He's probably heading right over. Yeah. You you couldn't have hit him at a better spot. <laughs> <laughs> oh, sweet. There you go, man. First boo. Not a bad one. Little little bull. Pretty guy. We better get after it, huh? Time to get to work. Time to get to work. Well, we're all loaded up. What do you think that weighs? 200 pounds. <laughs> it's not that much. I got to throw those hindquarters on my back. But we got about a mile and a half to go. We got her. So all on the back. This is the price you pay hunting. So here we go. All right, so we got our meat, and what better to do than cook some on a spit over the fire and have it for dinner. This is just some neck meat, so it's going to be kind of tough, but it's kind of fun. Just kebab it on. There we go. That's what we got. Two pieces of camp meat. This is just neck meat. Figured we'd just have it. Have, have, get a taste of our caribou. Joe's caribou. Mm. Good stuff. A little tough, but here's the neck meat, but it's good. <laughs> well, we got the thread going, and I'm just sucking on the side here. The water's really hurting, so we can't see a thing. So we're hoping to find a little bit. This is the first time we've got it going this year. Well, we 
we packed up camp and now we're heading out. Got some mud holes to make it through. Kind of rainy today, so we went back another way where we don't have the same creek crossings. And uh, that keeps us a little bit safer. Anyhow, just got to fight the mud holes. and mosquitoes. Here's what we're going into. Ugh. Not excited about that. But we gotta go that way. Well, we caught up to the storm and we got a little bit of hail. And hopefully it don't get much bigger than this because it's gonna hurt to ride. Pretty small now. Well, we made it back safe and sound, and uh, we'll show you back. We'll, we'll show you back at home what we got for gold, and we'll take care of our caribou. So, pretty awesome. Well, we found about a gram of gold. Here it is in the pan. But the water out at the mine was a little bit high and it made it really hard to do any dredging. So we only got two hours in. Leave us a like, leave us a comment, and if you haven't already, please subscribe.